All right, got an unboxing to do. Actually, it's an unbagging. This haggis sized package is from a Facebook uh, YouTube friend of mine, uh, Dean, and it is basically a um, bivy bag from Snugpack. And I need one for my sleeping bag. So let's see here. Let's see if I can do this without any sort of cutting implements. Now these retail for um, like just here on the snug pack website this retails for 69.95 pounds 70 quid basically and I paid less than half of that I'm surprised at how small it is original bag wow that is tiny pretty bag olive let's see um, snug pack bivy bag is made in the UK for UK weather conditions protecting you from evaporation and convection heat loss and one of the 10 essential items for hill walking and mountaineering. The BB bag is listed as an essential item within the freedom of the hill system approach to hill walking, providing emergency shelter for anyone participating in ventures and expeditions, lightweight, waterproof and windproof. The BB bag provides protection from weather elements all year round and is small enough to be carried on its own for emergencies as well as used in conjunction with an entire sleeping system for wild camping and tent based camping ventures. Weighs 300 grams, breathable, high moisture vapor transmission rate helps to keep you dry when you're active, lightweight, made in UK, stuff sack which is this, and 100% waterproof to keep you dry, manufactured in the UK. Available in three colours, black, coyote tan and olive. So, let's have a look at this. Alright, I'll change camera angles and put this on the other monopod and we'll put it to the test. Sleeping bag has been on the floor for a few seconds and somebody makes themselves at home. Hey, What do you want? Come on, get off it. I don't want any claws digging in. Come on. Shoo. Shoo. No. Hey. Yeah, go away. Okay, this is my snug pack sleeping bag and I've got my extender panel right there because I've got broad shoulders yeah keep on walking you Yeah, 
is pretty much the same size. It doesn't feel like, it doesn't look like Gore-Tex only sort of breathe ball material on it looks, it's almost a rubberized finish on the inside. See you. Yeah, it's watching everything I'm doing. Right, it fits. The only thing I'm slightly concerned about is the width, because as I said, uh, I've got an extender panel, so that is the width for the actual sleeping bag with the extender panel added it's a bit bulky but um, I'll crawl in and see how it fits but I just have to check upstairs because I think the cats are fighting hold on right moon shot this is snug. Feel like a caterpillar. And see, there is not much room to move. There are two budgies up there looking at me, giving me a funny eye. I don't blame them. They're probably wondering what this big grub is on the floor. <laughs> Buster just came out from the kitchen. Meow. What's he doing? You're wondering what the hell I'm doing, aren't you? Well, one thing's for sure. I don't fit in here. Be great for you. But, um, yeah. Oh, my camera just recognised its face. Facial recognition has just picked up uh, Buster's face. Budgies. Oh, so I wonder what the hell I'm doing. Well, the girl isn't, the boy is. Alright, well. Yeah, 
this is about as far as I can get into it. With my arms out, it's okay, but um, yeah, it's a bit snug. All right, now to get out of here. That's usually pretty easy. Got much more freedom of movement now. We'll be extending the panel fully up. So much more room. I can actually roll around inside. That's the difference. The sleeping bag was as snug as that bivy bag when I first got it. But with this extender panel, which is, goes from here to here, you can see here's the zip. Stuck. There we go. And the bottom bit. That's the size of the extender panel. What? Uh, also made in the UK. And so with that on there, it increases the size of this quite significantly. So if I need a bivy bag, I need to find one with you know a large size. So I guess I can use that as a giveaway or maybe a trade. Alright well it's worth a go. Thanks anyway, Dean. I won't be able to use it because it's too small, but now I have something else in my inventory that I can use for trade, or bartering, or prize giveaway, or something like that. He's a good boy, he responds. Oh, hello. Look at you. You joining in? trained properly but you got too much attitude. Alright guys, thanks for watching. See you next time.